Hello everyone and welcome to a requested Wizard 101 episode. Um, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get code wands in this game and what or and how to get them. So first off you need fishing. You need a pretty high level in fishing. So let me go to my fishing. So fishing, um, wherever I can find it, activities here. You need at least rank five to six uh, rank in fishing. And another requirement for fishing um, to get the code wands is, of course, to finish the Dragon Spire fishing quest from this fisher over here, Yuri Smokes Snake Snare. So, of course, to get to this world, you have to be at least level 40. Or if you have friends who beat Mushu and stuff, you can just teleport to them to come here and teleport to someone as Zafaria to get the code ones. You don't necessarily have to be level 60 to get them, but it's nice to have some code ones for looks and stuff. Now, this wizard is my fishing wizard, so the reason why I'm on my max ice right now instead of the max storm or myth that you guys already seen already, I'm on my max ice, of course, now. Um, so I'm going to be doing the tutorial on this character because of that and he's pretty much the only character I have who's high enough a level to do this. So first thing you guys want to do, you want to talk to the fisherman in Wizard City to start the fishing quest and then finish the Grizzleheim one and then he'll lead you off to this guy right here who has some, he, he also has some training spells that you can learn from him. Um, one of the quests you absolutely need to do is to get, where is it, um, he gives you this, Banish Sentinels, rank 1. You need this to get the code wands, like, in order to fish the chest out of the water in Gra Elfin Graveyard, you're going to need this spell, which you get from this guy right here. He gives he gives you a quest to go find fishes around Dragon Spire here. And once you finish that, he gives you that spell. So you need that spell. And go ahead and get some of the spells he has on there. They're pretty useful. Um, and I will also show you guys another handy spell to get, which is back in the Labyrinth. So let me just go to the Labyrinth here, back at Abelissa. And the Labyrinth is the next location which is through the crucible portal here or necropolis my bad necropolis portal so through the necropolis portal um you want to go to this fishing trainer um i believe his spells are rank five to get them so once you rank five you should be able to get the enough fishing requirements to fish an elephant graveyard I believe so let's go in here and yes I'm I'm wearing code wand already on this wizard um, a fox staff I got the fox staff from him on him just because it looks cool and I fished for it as well so I might as well show you guys how to get it so help you guys out on how to get these wands these cool looking wands to stitch on your wands so here we go we are going to speak to Dimitri Iron Chains here actually not Dimitri Iron Chain. this guy right here two more flamecaster you want to he has spells in here which he will give you which are these he gives you window life fish and window eyes you know you want this one the death one from him you might as well get all the rest of them i believe he's either rank five or rank six i can't remember but i believe he was rank five to eat be able to train these so you guys want to be at least rank five or rank six fit and fishing to get this this is very much needed for the code wands so you guys want this spell and you want this spell and what you also want is to have, you don't really need the rank 3 lures, which you can get in Grizzleheim. You don't need those. You want the rank 2 death lure to get the code wands. So, since I showed you guys where to get those, we are going to show you 
where um, to get the uh, code wants from. So here we go. You have to go to Zafari here, which is on the third page at the top. So you go to Zafaria, and what you guys want to do is go to the drum jungle here. Actually, the graveyard. There's a portal straight to the graveyard now. So just go to the graveyard if you've been here before. And what you want to do is come over here. Don't necessarily have to follow me exactly. There's probably a quicker way to do it. I just went this way just because and come to the edge of the water right here now what you want to do is you first want to get rid of all the sentinels in the water so you want to use this spell in this water here and it'll get rid of all the sentinels so they don't ruin you in fishing so once you get all the sentinels removed you just need to do one more step before you start fishing and that is uh, window away everything but death fish so you want to window away everything but the death fish which will get rid of all fish but death fish so it's doing its thing okay so all the fish in this area right now are death fish so the next thing you want to do is get a rank 2 lure out like so and you want to fish the death fish out of the water. Now it's not guaranteed that you'll get the ch chests um, like I got Codfather here. You'll get other fish here and there. It just all depends. Alright, let's get this one. There we go. Another Codfather. Okay, you just want to move on the edge here until you can find some fish like these that are easy to catch on the edge because you can't really reach them all the way out there. Just got to play around with it. Another Codfather. Eventually you'll get a death chest which is where the code wands are from but it's not guarantee that you get code wands you can get um, housing items and other items from it as well not just uh, the chests for the code wands now I got this fog staff the first first try on the code wand chest um, it spawned for me so yeah you just gotta play around like I am doing right now and hope that the fish come towards the ed edge here and eventually this one's gonna get it. there we go yep and they pretty much do it immediately and we got a massive reaper here soul searcher yeah okay and there's more here up oh, I don't have enough fish in my fishing basket one second guys let me just get rid of some of these fish that I don't need I don't need no Char decoys. Uh, too many codfathers. You can just trash on trash any useless fish here. Um, eventually you guys are gonna have to do this too, just trash a whole bunch of fish if you fish here a lot to get the code wands. It just happens. Let me just get rid of all these fish real quick. Just get rid of a few. Uh, okay, well there we go. A uh, very fast way to level up in fishing is just go to worlds where you haven't fished before, because there's a lot of there's new fish in every world, so you can pretty much go to any world, fish there, and you'll eventually get some fishes that you have not gotten before, and get XP for loads of XP for doing that. So I'm going to keep doing this until I get a chest here. So you guys can see that I'm not kidding ya, and you can get code wands from fishing these. That's how I got my fox staff. Yep, 
And they're pretty rare, so... I'm not gonna get it, like, exactly the first try. Some people like using luck potions. I don't tend to use them because there's a wait they're a waste of money. I'd rather just do this. I don't really come here often, so another fish. Okay. Uh yeah, you just wanna just keep coming down here. It's back and forth. Find a good spot. And that should be perfect. Yep, there we go. Eventually, we'll get a chest here. Another Codfather. Come on. Dang it. I lost that one. Yeah, that, so eventually, yeah. It'll eventually do it. Eventually come down here. So if you guys need any other tutorials, uh, just comment down below. Whatever you like to see. I will make a video of it. Um, but now... I'm just busy with life and school and work and all kinds of things, so I'm not making too many tutorial videos. I'm still releasing videos I made a while back on my death, who is, who I stopped making videos for for now until I can catch up um, to them because I'm a little I'm a little ahead of my videos. But my tutorial videos, they will pretty much be the day on or the day after when I release them. Alright. Another Reaper. Soul Sorcerer, whatever. If you guys also want to see my ice stats or what where I got my gear from feel free to ask I will do a arm a gear showcase on this ice wizard here who looks pretty nice um, this gear I stitched um, this ice wizard has the best ice gear I can find um, the only thing this guy needs is an ice pet. If any of you guys have an ice pet, like damage or resist ice pet, that would help me out a ton. If you guys have a triple damage, double resist pet, I would love to hatch with you guys because I'm doing sad on pets right now. Um, the only good pet I have is on this character who has a decent pet he doesn't have that bad of a pet of an ice pet um, could be better same thing with my storm I still need to work on my storm more my storm since the last video I made on him he's gotten more damage he's gotten a little bit better um, stats wise um, I can do an update on him and so you guys can see what I've been doing on him but his stats have been growing slowly, but I believe he's at like 120 damage now. And then I know the last video he was at like 115 damage and like 600 crit. He's at like 700 crit now. Ah, you know, you just lose some fish, some here and there, it just happens. Alright, we're just waiting on this. We're just waiting for one chest to pop up. Come on. Just give me one chest. Doesn't that, it can be a low-level chest? Come on. Just to show that there's a chest. Oh, another Codfather. Alright, um... Use this. 
Come on. I've gotten like six to seven chests last time I was here. So, this trip's just not lucky for me. Ah, I'm gonna have to go down here. Perfect. Immediately got that. Another Codfather. Don't need a Codfather. Okay, let's see if we can get this guy. He's eventually gonna hit it. So, think about fishing. It's all about patience and waiting for the fish to swim up to it. So, here we go. Nibbling on my hook here. There's a sentinel over there. Do not want to get too close to those guys. Another codfather. There's just so many codfathers here. Is that sentinel gonna come? He's looking at... Uh, I don't think that sentinel's coming. Hopefully not. So, when you do the sentinel, it only gets rid of half of them. The other half is over there. It doesn't get rid of those. So, gotta be careful when you come towards the middle here. I lost another one. Uh, okay, well, you just gotta keep fishing these guys, and eventually you can get the chest. And that was a little too far up there. Put it right in front of him. That's a beautiful one. There we go. There, I immediately got that. Another Codfather. Don't need a Codfather. No fish. We... Okay. We want to get the death fish here. Come on, go for that. Nope. Go for this, possibly. It's gonna land right on him. Ah, dang it. You just gotta play with the line here. The little lure. Alright, he's a that fish will eventually go towards it from there. Come on. Nope, not gonna work. Over here. Come on, you have to get that. There you go. Another soul searcher. My luck's just not not up to date here. Come on. Go for that, come on. He's not gonna go for it. Ah. Uh, I have to try to get these guys. See if these fishies here go for it. Come on, turn left, please. Turn to your left. Come on. That fish isn't gonna go for it. Um, right here, okay. He turned away at the last second. God dang it. Yeah. So get, this gets frustrating sometimes, as you guys can tell by my reaction to this. All right, come on. Another Codfather. 
It just happens. Please be a chest. Another soul searcher. Are you kidding me? Come on. And all the fish are not even close towards the edge. Alright, this one's the best bet right now. Come on. They turned away at the last second, and they're all along the opposite edge. Wow. Can we fish them from up here? I don't think we can. Will let us. Will let us fish from right here. No one won't. Okay. See a little fishing icon show up. Yeah. Okay, come on. You look like you're coming towards the edge here, so there we go. It's all about patience. Wait for the fish to tag your lure, just like in real life. I don't like how we can't like get in here and just like like we do in Dra Grizzleheim, Dragonspire, not Dragonspire, but Grizzleheim and Wizard City and some of the other worlds when we're able to get in the water. Dragonspire is kind of annoying than fishing because you have to stand on the edge like I'm doing right now and you can't really go in there. And you're just standing on the little edge of the lava trying to get the fish. And in Dragon Spire 2, you don't have the sent the thing that banishes the sentinels when you when you do the quest to get it. At first, so you gotta get rid of all the sentinels first. To fish. Ah, and that was another failed attempt. I can I swear I'm using the right the right lure here. Unless it's rank three. I don't believe the chests are rank three though. Unless they changed it. Because last time I was here I fished with rank two lure. And now I caught some. Unless I'm unlucky, I picked an unlucky side here. Another soul searcher. It's gonna be a long video because I'm just trying to get one chest. Just one chest. That's all I need. Got 19 energy left. Come on. We got another Codfather. Arr. Running out of fish on this side. Gosh dang it. I really don't want to refill my energy and waste some money on that. Uh, I might have to just to show you guys the chest. Eventually this fish will get there. Any time now. You turn. Yep, there we go. Please be a chest. I'm kind of tired of seeing all the Codfathers and Soul Searchers here. Oh my god. I have the worst luck. Another Codfather. I was a lot more luckier when I was here last time. I bet you all those fish that were scared away were chests. It's almost a guarantee. Okay, fish. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. There we go.
another Reaper. Ah, come on. We're gonna have to come over here, guys. And f I'm gonna have to refill on some energy here for you guys. So I can show you guys um, the chest. Alright, so we want to get rid of the sentinels first. Let's go get rid of the one all the way down there. There they go. And then we want to get rid of every fish except death. It looks like all these are death fish. Okay. The fifth, rank two lure here. That's rank three. All right, and we want to walk down here and catch this guy since he's closest. A little too close there. Oh, that should that should be perfect. Yep, there we go. Come on, give me a chest. Another soul switcher. Wow. I'm going to run out of room again here soon. It's going to be a long video because of all this fishing I need to do just to get one single chest. Alright, come on. Another soul searcher. Let's see if I can get this one. Ah, yes. Another soul searcher. This whole side is soul searchers. <laughs> Another soul searcher. There we go, guys. There we go. So, these are the chests I'm talking about. Um, this is obviously not a code wand chest, but um, there are chests with code wands in this area. This is just a, um, like I said, a housing one. Um, there's, there are some ones with wands but they're pretty rare to get so you just gotta be patient to get these chests so at least you guys seen the chest but I do want to try to get a wand here so I'm still gonna fish alright so we want to keep trying so we can try to get a wand here if not that's fine Come on. There's oh, come on. Got away. They eventually get away too sometimes. It's just it just happens. It's all luck. If you add the fishing luck, then you'll pretty much get them back to back but th it happens sometimes another soul searcher wow these guys wow they just are plentiful here aren't they oh no we got sentinel here that just spawned gonna steal our thing there 
Well, there's another sentinel. Why are they spawning so fast? What's up with that? We're gonna have to banish the sentinel again. The banishing smell. Get out of here, no one likes you. Dang sentinel. Alright, um... Oh, hey, more fish just respawned. Lovely. I was right on top of that fish, okay. Is that another sentinel? That's another sentinel. God dang it. I have to get rid of that sentinel here real quick, guys. Get out of here. Alright. And we want to get... Uh, we want to get this fish here. Come to Papa. Hang on. Since these fish respawned... We're going to have to get rid of all the ones that aren't death. Okay, all of those weren't death fish. Okay. Weed out the ones that aren't. Alright, please be a chest. A code one chest. Another reaper. <sighs> Come on. Don't have... I ran out of room in my fish... Fish thing again. All these cod fathers and all these... Soul searchers. Yeah, I don't really care for any fire kudos or any of that. Yeah, get rid of all, get rid of all these. Got plenty. Alright, that should be good. Let's continue on to get, hopefully get a code wand. If not, if we get a wand, that's fine. Another soul searcher. Arr. Come on. Just give me. Just give me one. One more chest. One more chest. Come on. Uh, one of these has to be a chest. Yes. It's a chest, another one, but it's another housing chest, not a wand chest. We want to get a wand chest. So hopefully we will find one here soon. Another soul searcher. How about one of you guys over here? Ah, not lucky. Another soul searcher. Wow. Okay.
eventually here. Wow. I want to. Okay. Please be a chest. Uh, it is a chest, but it's another housing chest. The troll chest. Ah, uh, come on. At least, at least we've been getting chests, though. I mean, they're they're chests, but they're the wrong kind of chests. We want the wand, the wand chests, not the not the housing chests. Another soul searcher. God dang, those guys are so uncommon. Alright guys, one more fish. And I'm just going to call it quits. For the video. After we get this fish here. Immediately got that. Wow. Another soul searcher. Okay. Well, we were unsuccessful. We were just unlucky today, guys. Um, that is pretty much how you get code wands in this game. If you guys really want code wands to get your characters a good look, you it's it's gonna take hours, guys. You just have you just have to be very lucky to get a code wand chest like I did. Um, the very first day I came here, I got the f the one I wanted, the fox staff for my ice wizard, um, which is this one right here, one of the code wands, the fox staff, which I got from here fishing with the rank two death lure. Um, so I hope this video helped you guys. Um, we did get some chests, but they were the wrong kind of chests here. Um, you just gotta be lucky, and. Yeah, so if you guys have the fishing luck gear or something, go ahead and use that. It's going to help you a lot and give you better chances on catching those rare chests which you get the code wants from. So I got this staff from there, and you guys should be able to get one too. And hopefully you get the one you guys want because otherwise you're going to be here for probably a couple of days or just long hours just spinning crowns getting that energy so I don't recommend doing energy I, again just don't waste money on the energy I don't really like to waste my money on the energy um, I only did it for the video so just go ahead and fish once a day here and then probably just go quest until eventually you'll get a code wand but it may not be the one you like but hey it may be good for a different wizard I just got lucky with the fox staff here so yeah again um, if you guys want or have any suggestions for any tutorial you guys want me to do on what on how to do and maybe dealing with pets or farming or how to get this gear how to, what kind of gear I got and how and where I got it from. It took me a pretty long time to get this gear on this guy. So, yeah. So, there you guys go. Max, my Max, um, Ice Wizard here. Hunter Iron Cloud. 90 damage, 53 resist. Overall, 14 accuracy. And 500 crit, 250 block, 9 armor pierce, 32 healing in, and 105 power pip. So, if you guys want to, uh, me do a gear showcase on this guy, I'll, sh I'll show you guys a little bit. But, 
Right now, this is the pet I have. I'm hoping to get a better one. I have a better one, my Death Wizard. I'm training up on him because he, my Death Wizard is my farming wizard. That's where I got my all my mega snacks and stuff off of. Um, I forgot I had this, but yeah, it's pretty much it. And thanks for watching, guys. Um, if you guys want me to do a gear showcase on any of my wizards, uh. My max, I have four level 120 characters and a level 63 character and a level 103 character. Of course, the level 103 character is my death wizard. I'm doing the walkthroughs currently on. So if you guys are interested in the walkthroughs, go ahead and watch them. Um, you might find some useful solo activity or tricks that I used in the dungeons there as a death wizard and you can learn the boss's cheats ahead of time by watching his walkthrough through from Azteca to Mirage. So feel free to watch those videos. I got like about 63, 64 I think right now. So feel free to watch those and feel free to watch my other tutorials. And if you guys, again, if you have any suggestions, please post them below. And I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. And slap that like button if you want to see more. Nature out.